What's up, guys? Welcome back to episode two of uh, World Tour. So I was going to use the Azeron. I did set it up to to use it in World Tour mode, but I just don't. It's just not like it's not as comfortable to use uh, for doing like um, for doing like uh, like if I want to do manual inputs. Like using a joystick is, it would be fine, but like it's just you to how the joystick is positioned. It's really only meant for like you know moving around, not for like precise fireball inputs or backwards fireball inputs. Backwards fireball inputs or, in, or fireball inputs when I'm trying to do something toward toward me, right? Like because that's how like the joystick is. Whatever. It's it's not as comfortable. It's not as comfortable to use. So I'm just going to straight up use um controller. regular xbox controller and um we're gonna get started and uh <laughs> back in back in world tour um i haven't really like checked the buttons for how to play on a regular controller but i mean it's not that much different you know i'll find i'll figure it out pretty quick all right here we are back um i turned the graphics settings down some let me see let me turn the textures back up because the textures are looking pretty uh sad there maybe it's supposed to look like that oh, no 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 there there it is it loaded in i was getting ready to say i was like nah i can't be can't look like that right um okay so let's just go let's go fight a dude real quick Come here, come here, come here. Yeah, yeah, you. Are you? Yeah, I don't know. I don't. I don't know loot combos. I don't know loot things. But we're in modern controls. We're mashing. We're mashing. Um, <laughs> I mean, I am indeed mashing in world tour mode because. Cause I, cause it's like you're just gonna have you're just gonna be switching your moves up and all the time and then sometimes maybe i might like figure out like okay you could do these combos you could do certain combos if you have certain you know specials or moves or whatever um, okay we're all, we're at level eight yeah I actually um I, I i opened up world tour mode a few times uh on steam deck and uh while i was out and just you know fought some people just walked around this area and just fought people i wish i could put my hat on backwards but they won't let me put my hat on backwards so uh yeah all right let's talk to let's talk to luke what's up how's the city uh treating you uh getting some practical experience on the streets um coach we're really getting stronger by the by running around are, are we really getting stronger by running around like this hold up hold up you doubt the wisdom of old Luke Sensei? Let's see where you're at then. All right. Don't worry about taking turns, both of you. Let's go. All right, man. All right, man. You better be on like level eight difficulty. Oh. 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 Wait, where's my help? Get him. Oh, nah. Oh, nah. He got way more health than he's supposed to have, bro. Ain't no way. Can I, do, can I drive her? Yo. Yo. Oh, God. Well, that was embarrassing. Uh, he, had way, he had way too much health. We were just 100% supposed to lose that. I'm at level 8. He was at level 10. He didn't expect me to actually so, go level up and fight check people. Check out the city, see the sights, rack up some wins. And then you come back with the confidence to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with your lovable coach. 
Guess that practical training paid off in spades. Am I right? Yeah, sure, sure, sure. You want to make it in this world? Sure. You got to do what you can. Grind like crazy. Not let up. Not for a second. Yeah, you and your pink hat. Long, but you just got to take it one step at a time. That first step you both took just now? something to be proud of man you two are great students i think i'm gonna change my eye i might change like if whatever they show us the body shop or wherever the body shop thing is i think i'm gonna change my eyes to normal just for the for the time being until like i don't know maybe i get really really cool clothes or something and it, and it looks dope to have like my eyes like that because right now it just just looks weird. I was like, ah, oh, it'd just be better to just have regular eyes, like my regular eye color. And then it'll be closer to what I actually look like rather than having, like, you know, yellow eyeballs. <laughs> huh. You know what? You make a darn good team. I don't think it'd be the worst thing for you two to take on the world together. I don't know about this guy, bro. Together? Absolutely. But I want to go so low. Training like we did at the gym and around Metro City. Then the two of you can go and travel the world. You can really get to know each other and take on all comers. Can we? Seriously, you'll have a blast. I'm sorry, I can't. I can only do things. I need to be strong, and I need to be it now. I'm not like you. Oh. You go around treating this like a game. Boss, what do you mean? Coach. You can't. Done with the course. You can't be strong God, now, no matter what you do. Care of. But you're right. This did give me something strength. wrong with you. Thank you. Our only fight ended in a draw. Wish we could have had a rematch. Oh man, oh, don't go, man. We gotta find some more. Yo, this is this is a teach you a lesson about ranking up in Street Fighter. Because I mean, I kind of I, I be kind of feeling that way sometimes when I'm like trying to trying to rank up, trying to beat people, and trying to get better at the game. And like, um, I just get frustrated with myself, and I'm just like, well, you know, yeah, I guess you don't have to. Like, you just you're gonna lose games. You're gonna lose games. And in order, in, and you'll and you learn from those losses, and you'll get better, which I've been doing. I went to the tournament yesterday. I went one and two. Okay, I could have done better in my first match. I didn't warm up. That was a mistake. Um, and I lost to the first guy I played who was playing Luke. Uh, let's just hope he doesn't stumble down any weird rabbit holes. Uh. You know, to be honest, I don't consider myself much of a teacher. Press said I was too much of a hothead. Had me teach new students to help chill out, chill me out a bit. How can I put this? I'm giving an old college try, uh, but maybe my methods could use a little work. Moving on. Anyway, that does it for today's lesson. I'll contact you using the this sucker moving forward. Ah, right. Yeah, this uh, this thing, whatever this is, I'll contact you using that. If you see Alice, tell her I said uh, thanks for helping out with the lesson plan. All right. <laughs> She's got a ton to teach you, so I hope you two don't beat each other up too much. Obtained rising uppercut. Okay. Cart. So we got a we got our first. I guess this is our first master or first master action that we have. Like, where is it? Where is the setting? Master actions, rising uppercut. Those on. Rising uppercut. Let's see. Let's try to hit this guy. Wait, let's 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 fight this guy. This guy's level nine. I'm level eight. Rising uppercut. In game. Oh God. Rising uppercut. Oh God. That's 
not my assist button. Where's my assist button? Oh Lord. Lord. Get him. Throw him again. Get him. Let's go. Throw, throw, throw. get some food replenish my health uh, I'm not gonna fight the guy that feeds me wait for once I finish Luke's mission bro how'd it go uh you came all the way over here just to thank little old me come on it's been my pleasure how about you uh starting to get what the strength business is about it's hard to read this font over all these colors <laughs> like i get it now right on you fancy yourself a quick learner do you i feel like you're getting ahead of yourself but i like the confidence so hypothetically speaking let's say somebody me for example gave you a list of step-by-step -step instructions on how to get strong if you followed those instructions to the letter would you be satisfied with the result Kind of, but like I, what I would do is I would take the information that you gave me and I would extrapolate it into everything else that I need, right? And if I run out of things to to think about or to, to, to use, I'm like, okay, you can give me some more information, then I can extrapolate that information and uh, use it to get stronger. <laughs> <laughs> I'm applying this to like real life and like how I go about learning Street Fighter, pretty much. This is going to be, this is going to be a... Um, a lesson for me probably through throughout this thing it's gonna be like the moral of the story is uh you can't rush being strong right so you, it takes a long time a lot of practice blah 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 you know, that whole thing strength is something we all must find out on our own uh and in order to find it out uh in order to find it you gotta you gotta talk to people just like you're doing now you want to look for fighters worthy of being called legends and ask them uh to impart their teachings to you take my take my style for example i learned it from a fighter named chun li <laughs> if you're looking for a, a guide a guide post towards strength call your very own uh it, i'd be well worth heading to it'd be well worth heading to chinatown to meet with chun li and learn her style All right, points called miles are earned through the game by performing various actions. A notification will appear when you earn miles. Miles are used to continue after a losing battle. Oh, okay. Uh, the city contains a wealth of things to see and do. You can chat with people you meet, do part-time jobs for Zenny, or even find rare items in most unexpected places. The people you meet along your journey will show you the path forward and help you grow as a fighter. Clear. Completion rewards 500 miles, iron bar, karma. New items available at the shop. You can check the shop locations via the map. Okay. Chapter two. So we're in chapter two now, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're in chapter two now. Okay, let's, let's see if there's any new stuff in this shop, actually. Mix and match parable gear. Certain pieces of upper body gear are considered parable. Uh, and can be worn alongside other gear. Par uh, parable clothing can be found in selected via the upper body gear category by experimenting to see what pieces of gear are parable. Oh, oh try experimenting. Uh, re regardless of how pair, how do you pair items, it will not affect their original parameters. Okay. Uh, change the color of stuff. Change the color of pants. You lack required materials. Okay. All right. 
should sell that stupid thing. Okay, now we got some. Oh, we got a we got a backwards cap. I'm just gonna. I'm more most likely gonna buy that. I'm just gonna buy this backwards cap. Yep, 100%. Purchase backwards cap. Equip gear. Yes, thank you. Here we go. I'm trying to. He just kept spinning around. Uh, shoes, sneakers. You need some different pants. I'm still tired of those pants. Jeans, yes. Uh, we don't have enough for these jeans though. Cat ears, no. I do wear glasses. Right? I do wear glasses sometimes, but I don't have my glasses today. Twelve hundred. I would get these Beats. These Beats by Capcom. So this is the only thing we have right now. I'm definitely not buying the cat ears. I don't want the cat ears. Okay. So we need to. Oh, let me let me sell something. Can I sell something for? I'm gonna sell this stupid hat. Okay. I'm gonna sell. Can't sell any of these things. Twenty. Nothing else really worth selling. Maybe I'll sell. I'll sell these because I don't really need them right now. Sell these. How much do I need? For these pants, 1,100. So, uh, I can just sell one. Okay, I can, I can buy, I can buy the pants. I can buy some jeans, some regular jeans to get rid of those ugly, uh, yellow pants. Thanks. Oh, there we go. This, oh, this is better. This is, this is so much better. Sure you good. Come out. Hey, look at my clothes. I need to I need to recoup some money. Come here, guy. Yo, he, isn't that CVS? Isn't that CVS roll? Ah, look at my clothes. <laughs> Leveling your styles. Earning enough of styles experience will cause the style to rank up, increase. If you increase your style rank, your master. Uh, in that style might teach you new moves the next time you talk to them. Uh, you may also gain a stat boost. Style experience can be earned in large quantities by talking to masters or by fighting against citizens who use that style. Okay. While exploring the city, you may sometimes notice citizens with master icons attached to them. Uh, okay. Uh, these citizens are talented fighters who use the moves of that icon's corresponding legendary fighter and will yield a large amount of style experience if defeated in battle. All right. So like these these people don't have any of those uh, things. Details uh, hit with 10 attack. Oh, so if you hit them with 10 attacks, you get 181 Zenny. Land the first attack 500 miles. Oh, so what if I just do this? It wouldn't this be wouldn't this be wouldn't this count as the first attack? What you looking at? Oh, wait. Doesn't that count as the first attack? Right. Oh, I'm burned out. That was. No, 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 it was only. Okay. Oh, I need, I need to go. I need to go. Wait, where's the guy with the food truck? Oh, here he is. I get you? Only I don't have that much money. Spot me something. I need 150. Thanks for stopping by. I gotta go fight people till I get it. Oh, whatever. Wait. I thought I was gonna get money from. Oh, I gotta hit. I had to hit her with 10 attacks. Did I not hit her with 10 attacks? What about this person? Uh, details. Knocked down three times. 663 zenny, right? I know she's in the middle of a conversation. <laughs> oh, I have health. Yo, 
come here. Come here. Okay, we got, we got, we got 500 miles. We got, but my, my life came back, right? I guess we don't, we don't really need to, um, do anything. Let's just go. Let's go to the next, uh, the next, the next marker. Oh, wait, what? Who's this guy? Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. This is the, the chick's brother, right? Hey. Uh-huh. So you're going to travel all over to get stronger from, from here on out, right? Probably a, a good time as any to take the bus. Oh, you can take the bus. Okay. Oh, good. We got fast travel. A uh, Chinatown's that away. Hard to miss. Big gate. Anyway, good luck out there. After, uh, after, after examining a bus stop for a first time, it'll become uh, available as fast travel location. Selecting it via the map in your device will allow you to travel there instantaneously, even from very far away. Uh, make an effort to check out every bus stop you have upon across the city there are also fast travel points that can be unlocked via via missions look out for people wearing t-shirts with a bus motif uh if you're a fan of fast travel it could be worth your while to talk to them i mean i'm that definitely will be unless there's some other way to go around I, oh this must be the thing you're talking about okay activate fast travel god dang that looks terrible hold on let's see something I'll turn on uh shader quality high uh, texture quality high Does that help no i don't know maybe maybe i helped it i don't know maybe i helped the frame the frame rate a little bit i don't know i don't know man i don't know all right let's go let's uh let's travel over here to the next uh next area wait what was that i picked up a zenny off the ground like off the ground no. like there's there's just money laying on the ground Disappointed in you, Li Fen. It's all that fooling around on your PC. If they would have messed fooling up around? fooling around on your PC, good. Yo, if they would have messed up Chun Li's face in this game, the, this Sorry this game would have tanked. Would have tanked. Nobody would have played it. I'm Chun Li. Is there something I can help you with? See you're in pursuit of strength. Hmm? Correct. That's a feeling I understand all too well. I've had a long career as a fighter myself. I face all kinds of opponents that include fiercely powerful foes and friends forged in the fires of competition. To be honest. He was like, oh, all, right, "All right." But after all these years of fighting, I decided I might. Uh, it might be time for a break. That's why I'm here teaching the locals kung fu. Now then. I can't promise it. I can't promise it will provide you with the strength you're looking for, but I'd be happy to teach you a thing or two. Now then. Come on, 
hurry. <laughs> Look at me, uh, look at me out there doing kung fu. With a Philly FGC shirt on. <laughs> Definitely would be me. I wouldn't even I wouldn't even make it up that high. You became Chun Li's student. You can now use her fighting style, basic moves, and unique unique attacks. You also learned her master action. Uh fire key blast directly for useful for attacking opponents at range. Spinning bird kick. A series of rotating upside down kicks with your legs. Extended wide, this move does a lot of damage and useful for for uh, useful when performing combos against opponents that have left themselves wide open. Uh, becoming someone's student grants you access to more styles, but you can only use uh, a single style at any given time. So finding the style that suits you, uh, your own approach to combat is key. To change style, open the status via app, uh, status app via your device. You'll find the uh, select you'll find the style select option at the top of the gear menu scour the lands for legendary fighters to study under and try as many styles as you can special moves uh you've learned are yours to use as you like even if you change your styles by completing i mean by combining the special moves of different legendary fighters you can design a fighting style that's entirely your own customize them by opening your device selecting status and then special moves the number of shown on the upper right gives the general idea of the damage output, but factors like your level will affect this. Special moves must be set for each style and control type, and changing one of these will change your setup. All right. I gotta fight these other people, right? Chain spinning bird kick. I got spinning bird kick. Spinning bird kick. My bad. I should have read. I should have. Well, no, I hate her by accident. I didn't even see what the details were. Does it tell you the details here? Oh, you can pause it and show the details. Uh, hit with five unique attacks. Is that one? No. Was that one? No. Was that one? No. Okay. I, I, I guess I just don't know what that means. I figured they meant like unique attacks, like command normals. All right, Luke, level three. All right. Talk to Lee Fen. Do like level twelve. Details. Hit with a ten hit combo. Yeah, not gonna happen. Uh, <laughs> double KO gum. Hit with ten kicks. Defeat using Chun Li's style. Oh, let me let me let me go to the thing, go to status, right, and then go to special moves or masters, right. A list of legendary fighters that you train under. You can view your style ranks and in your bonds with masters. Whenever you pursue perfection under a single master, you play the field uh, or play the field and study under multiple masters it is entirely up to you. Uh, you can check this menu to see if new conversations with your masters are available or if you have a new move or if they have a new move to teach you. 
All right. Oop, style. Chun Li style. Okay. Pants. We keep the. Oh, wait. No, we don't take the shoes off. Shoes on. Training gloves. Yeah, I'm going to take the training gloves off because they're just yellow and they're just annoying. <laughs> Uh, can I save here? Save current gear set? It's my, my Philly FGC attire. This is going to a local... Going to the local... Going to a local attire. <laughs> Alright. Missions. Alice mentioned a fighter named Chun-Li who is apparently in Metro City... In Metro City's Chinatown. 2000s any blue dye. Or she's considered a living legend. You should try to meet her yourself. Talk to Chun-Li students. Okay. Sup? That means big sister, just so you know. Not not that we're actually related or anything. I basically just hang out and soak up her coolness uh, and her cash. <laughs> okay, so I don't have to. F I guess I don't have to fight him yet. I could fight them though if I wanted to, right? Hit with two aerial attacks. We let, let me uh, let me spinning bird kick this person real quick. I missed. I missed. I hit the wrong person. <laughs> Burned out. Oh God. Wait, where's? Okay. Oh, this is much harder. Okay, this is light, medium, and heavy. Back heavy. This is this is. Oh, I didn't set my special moves. Okay, there there. Okay, that is my that's my assist button. Okay, there we go. Okay, okay, cool, 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 cool. Okay, let me let me. I didn't say any special moves. Oh wait, no, I, I do have special moves. Okay, spinning bird hit Kyoken, Kikoken. Okay. Uh, okay, now I'm gonna rising uppercut this guy right here. Six six six. Yo, I died. Oh, snap. I didn't have any health. Wait, rise up. <laughs> yo, Chun Li style, yo. Oh, wait, let me wait. Just talk to me for a second. My bad. Hello? Let's talk to me. Hold on. I'm sorry for punching you in your face. You student, eh? Uh, what do you say a little about a little sparring? We just did. We just, we just did. I, ju I just. was it could you tell that you and i move the same way yes yes i could indeed because we're both using chun li style given that we're her students and all even if you're doing something as simple as throwing a punch the movements change entirely from style to style picking a master whose style is a good fit for you is one of the fundamentals of success and if you prefer luke's style you can always switch back to it from your status app cool 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 Oh. Greetings, young one. Did you choose to become Chun Li's student after being captivated by her beauty? 
um, it was I was kind of captivated by uh, moving forward in the story, but sure. Oh, you need not or, or no need to worry. You'll get no judgment from me. Choosing teachers on a whim is perfectly fine. That said, putting your heart into studying under one master and honing their craft is an e is an equally viable approach. You can check who you're studying under in the opening by opening your device and selecting masters. This menu displays your bond points with each master, your rank in their style, as well as their profiles and information about their fighting technique. All right, let's talk to her. Have you heard of master actions? Yes, I have. I've been master actioning people all in this lobby in this area. <laughs> Master action to people in the back of their neck when they're not even looking, you know. Uh, incredible, would you would you say? Yeah, yeah, yeah it was pretty pretty incredible. All right, I already know this all about that. You, you you hold the trigger and then there's your master actions right there. Boom, you can use your master action. And sometimes you might need to use them to get across areas because I saw it in the. Um, oh snap! People just see you do it and they're like, "Yo, that's that's cool, yo! How do you do that?" Like, that's kind of weird. <laughs> Well, have you had a chance to talk to the other students and learn about uh, apprenticing? Um, I know you're currently trying to master my style, but I can't say I can't say for certain whether or not my techniques will be good a good fit for you. Only you can discover that style is true. Uh, discover the style that is truly yours, and the only time you can do that is in combat. <laughs> Our new student is serious about yeah. training. I see. If it's all right with you, uh, would you mind keeping an eye on Li Fen for me? She's quite talented, but I fear she lacks direction. Seeing someone diligent like you might light a fire under her. Seeing someone, seeing someone like you might light a fire under her ass, <laughs> so she can get moving <laughs> and stop playing on that goddamn computer. <laughs> um, details. Fight Shenley Bro profile name, gift. So you can give him a gift. You don't have any presents to give? Okay, cool. Uh, let's talk to Leafin. Gigi's always, uh, Gigi? Gigi, is that how you pronounce that? Gigi? Uh, is always nagging me about being on my computer all the time. Is that, is that, is she talking about Chun-Li? I wish she'd get it through her head that I'm, that, that I'm a, I'm a white hat hacker. I'm not just watching FooTube. Am I just watching food tube all day? And I mean, it's not like I don't like training or anything. I love to get ripped like you guys. What? This is not the type of training that gets you ripped. <laughs> oh, on that topic, there's been some guys uh, causing trouble around here lately. They call themselves the Canary Crate Gang. I guess because they wear yellow cardboard boxes in their heads. Whatever the case, they've been attacking people at random. Uh, well. If you're looking for an opportunity to test your skills, you could do that. You could, you could do that on them. What do you say going over to their turf and taking them down a peg or two? Now that you're Chun Li's student, you can use a spinning bird kick master action, right? With that, you can spin your way into action against the Canary Crate Gang. They hang out over the street. They hang out over on the street to the west and wear yellow carver boxes. You can't miss them. Victory is all about taking initiative. Landing a master action on your opponent is a great way to start a battle with tides already turned in your favor. Master actions all have different properties. They cost drive gates to perform, but they're way more than worth using proactively. Oh, is that why I burn out? Uh, 2000 Zenny and blue dye. Nice. Is that why I burn out? Because I use my master action? Wait, let me use my master action real quick. I never noticed that. I never noticed that. Does, they, does it come back? Oh, okay, it does come back. Okay, okay. It works like a regular drive meter. And I guess you have, like, you level up and you get more drive meters, right? And more, probably more health and stuff like that, right? Okay. Uh, Canary Crate Gang. Where are we going? Yeah, we got to go find the Canary Crate Gang. So go, go around here, I guess. Is this where I'm supposed to be going? Did I did I miss? No no no. Oh yeah, can't go this way. Cops are blocking the area off. Mm -mm. 
Like normally I would cut out the walking and stuff, but wait, let's climb this ladder because you know they showed in the thing that you can spinning bird kick across areas. What did I pick up? 14 zinni. Uh, me can I? I'll just master action my way across here, right? Oh yeah. Okay, cool. Those reasons to like. This is rising uppercut. This. I'm burned out. <laughs> uh, clear. Oh, gear. Clear. Gear coloring gem. Or why don't why what what where did I get gear coloring gem from? Like gem, gear coloring item, uh, a dying agent used to change the color of your gear. Okay, it's just, yeah, just the die stuff. Uh, Wesley, this is Wesley down there. Uh, spinning bird kick. All this money up here. How does money get on the roof? No, I didn't mean to do that. Missed out going over there. I could probably just climb up and go around this way, right? Yeah. Just destroying, just destroying the people's signs. Oh, I fell down. I, I wonder if it's, I wonder if it's anything important in that in that bin. I, I percutted the other one. There was some stuff in it, so I'm just gonna go back and get it. Is there anything in it? No, nothing. Okay, cool. All right, off to fight the the canary the canary hat gang or whatever. The the canary clan. There you go. No, oh, I think he tried to hit me. Bang. Who are you? Oh man, are we getting raided again? Raided? What the? Yo, right in the neck. One combo. Come on, we're just an up-and-coming gang that's trying to, the, it's darn just to be a big deal around here. We're just an up-and-coming gang. Yeah, we're just, we're just trying to make our name known by robbing people and causing trouble. Like, just, just leave us alone, man. Let us, let us get ours, man. Why is everyone out here looking to ruin this for us? <laughs> Don't you see how hard we're trying? <laughs> yeah, unfortunately. <laughs> Neck. <laughs> God. That's what you get when you grind up. Grind up. Level ten. Level ten before I even get here. What am I gonna do? Reality is a tough pill to swallow. Ain't a great look if people are trying to make it as gangsters keep getting whooped by regular old city folk. <laughs> Listen, I ain't regular old city folk. I'm from the FGC. <laughs> I'm not these 
casuals out here saying <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Can I duck? Can you duck? I don't think you could duck, right? Oh, I didn't know you could dash. I I hadn't I didn't even try to dash. Breaking signs using master actions. You guys are late. You guys are late. I already know. I already know. <clears throat> I thought I was going to fight that guy. You just standing up here. I was like, man, you about to get hit by this spinning bird kick. Oh, wait, what? I got to talk to you first. Uh, trigger pressure three times. Trigger pressure three times. Trigger pressure. Trigger pressure time three times. Wait, what does that mean? Yeah. Does that mean use the auto? When encountering a. When encountering boss enemies stronger than your average opponent, you may need to fight in a best of three match. <laughs> your vitality will be fully replenished for these fights, and they're not over until you've won or lost two rounds. So take care not to throw in the towel early or start your celebrations ahead of schedule. Your wins and losses will be shown at the top of the screen. I might actually start using the arcade stick for... um playing this game it may not be as comfortable to run around the open world i'll figure this out as the as the series goes on because if i'm using different styles and i'm doing it in like a setting like this then i might actually be able to learn some characters just in passing like just be able to learn some characters and some like like you know simple stuff to do with with each character play you know just play neutral learn how to play neutral with that character and stuff like that i don't know we'll see as this as it as it goes on like if i feel like using the arcade stick or not and just actually use it um maybe not maybe not going full classic controls maybe not but i knew you could still do you know classic inputs for um specials and stuff like that so maybe i don't know um your wins and loss will be shown at the top of the screen. Okay. When your opponent's body turns white during battle, that means that they're they, they are vulnerable. Landing an attack during this time will inflict more damage than normal. They do they have They show you what moves are um punish counter or punishable? Wow. World Tour will really do teach people how to play the game if you pay attention. Uh, at time which they will become vulnerable depends on the opponent uh, often occurring before or after they perform certain actions. Remembering these timings can be prove useful for gaining the upper hand in battles. Yo, you know what he play like? You know what he play like? He play like a lot of the silver silver rank players that I run into online. They just they just press buttons and they jump away, or at least some of them, like some of them. Like I've seen a lot of people that do that, do that and they try to win that way. Did they learn from? Oh. Yeah. 
it's hard doing it like doing the manual attacks on a control stroke. I'm also using the Let's see. I'm trying to do Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button. I'm pressing the I'm pressing the special button like like it was uh like it was medium punch. I was using medium punch. But medium punch and classic controls is is why and I, and I was pressing it and I was pressing it trying to do but that's my special button right now. If you're a friend of the guy from earlier, Bosch or whatever. Oh, are you? You came in it's not so long ago. Just like you're doing right now. Dudes with boxes on their heads. Yo, you look stupid. He dropped his card. Yo, he dropped his ID. Yo, he dropped his ID and, and some thugs picked it up. <laughs> some box thugs picked it up. Whoever that Bosch guy was, he squeezed us for info on Mad Gear and then bounce. You've heard of them, right? They're the one of the gangs in this town. Bosch wanted to know where they where they do business. I heard Mad Gear is in bed with some huge organization. Apparently, Bosch wants to swipe whatever cash is uh, what whatever cash is supposed to be. We're supposed to get passed around in the process. So I told him, of course, if you want to get your ass killed, by all means, be my guest, break a leg, maybe even a skull. If you're going after that fool too, let me fill you in on a little something. The deal's going to go down at night in an alleyway on the south side of downtown. So hold on a second. Bosch came through here, fought y'all, beat y'all up, and squeezed y'all for information, right? He squeezed y'all for information. I beat you. I didn't ask you no questions, and you spilled the beans on everything. Like, <laughs> I didn't even ask you. I was just like, oh, yeah, yeah, I know that guy. Oh, yeah, so he was looking for these dudes, and he went down here. The deal's going down this time, this place. It was like, dude, you just tell everybody? Like, you just, you just tell everybody? The ID card Bosch registered with with Buckler. He looks nervous in the photo. He's probably a little camera shy. Why is that even a thing? Uh, try using special moves to trigger pressure time. Pressure time. Pressure time. Landing a normal attack on an opponent who has changed color will trigger pressure time. However, if you can land a special move. It'll take you one step further. You'll put them into a stunned state. Learn your learn your own moves well. Observe your opponent's movement and aim for that perfect timing. Okay. Chun Li style. You got a thousand miles for that. Austin glasses. All right. Chapter three is unlocked. So we're gonna we're gonna cut it here. This is episode two. And in episode three, we're going to pick up on chapter three. Uh, I guess we'll do, I guess we'll do a chapter, a, a, an episode, I guess. Um, but yeah, I, I guess the, the game seems to be moving pretty fast. Um, we're in chapter three. I know, I know um, Kimberly is in chapter eight because I was going to, I was going to unlock her, um, uh, her costume by playing through world tour but i was like nah i'm not gonna wait i'm just gonna i'm just gonna buy it so i bought it with the uh, fighter coins and a couple of others but now that you know i'm playing through world tour i guess i will actually you know unlock the rest of the second outfits by you know unlocking them through world tour uh but yeah all right it's it's uh, it's it's been it's been a good game it's been a good game it's pretty it's pretty fun it's pretty uh entertaining so um uh, we'll be back uh, in our next episode. Thanks for watching. Please like the video if you liked it and subscribe to the channel. Please help me get to 1,000 subscribers. And uh, I would greatly appreciate it. Um, that's my goal this year. And uh, stay tuned for the next episode. All right, peace.